I'm Steve Gornick here at the Heinz Athletic Center where the Gales just wrapped up an 80 to 61 win over Siena. The Gales finished at 17 and 13 overall for the season with an 11-7 in conference record. I'm here with John Stanko of icgales.com. John, what were your thoughts about the game today? You know, about the game today, it was a really balanced performance. Five players in double figures for Iona, a very good job, and only 10 turnovers as a team, and they had a ton of points off Siena turnovers as well. It was a great overall, well, very well played game. It wasn't all Momo Jones, it's David Lowry also kicked in a great stat stuff for game. He had 13 points himself, Taj Lee had 14. And another big key, Sean Amon was able to plus out of his cold streak. So this season's been a bit tumultuous for the Gales. What are your overall thoughts of the year heading into the MAC tournament right now? This is a bipolar team, if you will. They play either really well or really bad at times. And we saw today there was a spurt in the second half where Siena got it to within nine points. We were all thinking as Iona fans, we're going to collapse again. Oh, no. But if it didn't happen. Iona closed out well, and I think that's big. The later half of the season, the past two games, Iona has closed out games. They've made their free throws throughout the game, and frankly, they've expanded leads instead of rather than, rather than seeing them shrink. So it's really big for the Gales so they can have them moving forward into the MAC tournament to be huge. Fan favorite Sean Armand had a tough first half today, and he's been in a bit of a slump as of late, but he had a strong second half. Is he going to be a key player heading into the MAC tournament? Oh, he's, at, he's a very key factor. He had 11 points today. All of them came in the second half. He shot four of eight in the second half after missing all of his shots in the first half. So to see him break out of his cold streak was really big. And him coming into MAC tournament time is going to be huge. He averages about 17 points per game. We've seen that dip the past three games. But if he can pick it up come Springfield, him and Momo Jones will tear up Springfield for sure. And now Iona is a four seed heading into the MAC tournament. Certainly, we're a bit of an underdog opposed to the favorite last year. Is that something that's going to work to this team's advantage? Well, don't tell Momo Jones because uh, he's like in the post game interview. He's just like, we are not the underdogs, and I think that this, this is the mentality the team has is that they feel they can beat anyone. And as Momo mentioned in the, pre in the post game as well, they've beaten everyone in the MAC, and they know they can do it. Now they go play Canisius, a tough team they, that they lost to last time they played them. Barron is a very dangerous player. But if Iona can get on a roll, especially offensively, and if they can get that fast-paced tempo, they will wreak havoc come back tournament time. Thanks a lot, John. I'm Steve Gornick from the Heinz Athletic Center. For more on what's going on in Iona Mass Communications, go to NorthAvenueNation.com.